I'm Cormac McSweeney in Ottawa, where a ruling has come down against a Canadian airline, which left passengers stranded inside two planes on a tarmac in the summer for up to six hours. Conditions became so bad that some passengers even called police. The Canadian Transportation Agency released its report into the incident today and places the blame solely on the airline, Air Transat. It's ordering the company to cover the out-of-pocket expenses for passengers caught in this extreme tarmac delay. In July, two flights, one from Rome and one from Brussels, had to be diverted to Ottawa and were left sitting on the tarmac for five to six hours. Passengers complained about the heat, then the air conditioning turned off. They ran out of food and water and still weren't let off the planes. Some passengers described how a child threw up and the smell wafted through the entire plane, causing others to feel sick. The conditions were so bad, one passenger called 911, prompting a response from police. The incident grabbed headlines around the world, and the airline tried to blame the Ottawa Airport Authority for this mess, but the agency is rejecting those claims. A representative from Air Transat was not immediately available to respond to the ruling, but the federal transport minister, Mark Garneau, uh, did say that he hopes that this brings some closure to the passengers who went through this ordeal. He also says it underlines the need to pass the government's Passenger Bill of Rights. It's a piece of legislation that is currently before the Senate. In Ottawa, Cormac McSweeney, City News.